Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name's Inside A Game and welcome to a new game, Coal Mining Simulator. Would like to thank the publishers at Game Planet and Playaway SA for sending us early access key. Now I've had this for about a week, uh, but unfortunately I've been away uh, as a lot of you have known. So look, this is going to be released tomorrow on the 11th of April 2023. Uh, so we're going to get a little bit of early access. We'd love to have got a lot more covered before then, but you know, it is what it is. So I'm quite excited for this game. We love our simulators here. Uh, so a little bit about this. Welcome to the world of coal mining. Start with the almost nothing and get to the top. Develop your mind, sell coal, buy new machines, avoid dangers in this sandbox simulator. So we get to create our own mines. Uh, we get to control mining machines, of course. Uh, there's a big sandbox experience by the looks of it. There is no end goal. The coal mining simulator, you can take contracts and complete specialist assignments to get unique rewards or follow your own path. The choice is ours. There are also dangers, uh, earthquakes, gas explosions. Be prepared for anything. Whatever you buy, you can very easily lose if we are not careful. So it all sounds very interesting. So let's get into it and start a new game. Okay, so welcome to our world. Uh, welcome to the world of coal mine. Entering the pickup truck. Um, we have no contracts currently. Uh, visually, it's quite nice, isn't it, out here? It looks all right. Okay, let's get in our truck. Hey, it looks all right. It looks all right. Okay, F engine. I managed to buy an old underground truck from my good friend. It has only one minor floor, one wheel, something. In that case, we'll have to drive to the local warehouse and buy a wheel and an engine. Okay, so literally, it has nothing. Alright, that's, that's not the best start. How do I get out of here? Okay, so there is a spot flashing. And I'm going the long way around, but there you go. Look, we can uh, check out the, uh, the streets. So we do have fuel here. So we'll have to be a little bit careful of that. And the city is called... Stoneway City or Stoneway. Okay, so we are needing to pop into here. And obviously, this is where we're going to find some equipment. Okay, let's just exit here. So, here we go. We've got quite a lot going on. Some, uh, big kind of machines. Right, so he wants us to buy a toolbox. How much money do I have to start with? Oh. Why can't I pick it up? Oh, I have. Okay. Follows me in a very weird way. Okay, let's get it in the back of the pickup truck. I think that's okay. And we need a big wheel. Hey, only $200 and it shrinks. Hey, that's not too bad. Okay, let's get this in the back of the pickup. Okay, they're both in there. I just want to have a look at the other stuff here. So, it doesn't actually say how much money I've got. I've got $40 left. So, there are loads of other cool things that it looks like that we'll be able to buy. But it doesn't want me to buy anything else at the moment. What's that? Premium oils, fishing rods. I'm not sure what all these bits are. Jerry cans. Security compartment. Oh, is that in case there's an explosion or something? Maybe that will save our lives. I don't know. Uh, okay, this is all pretty cool stuff. Generators. All right. Refuel a car, follow the arrows to get to the gas station. All right, well, we can do that. Apart from I can't see the arrows from in here. So, next camera is T. There we go. Still can't see any arrows, but straight down. Okay, so we just need to start fueling. I don't think there's anything special there. No. Okay. Do I need to grab the end? All right, we do. I didn't. I thought it was just going to do it itself. All right, in you go. Well, that's all my money if I do that. But all right, it is what it is. Okay, so off to the mine we go.
Okay, so we are here. This looks like it's our... Uh, unload the purchase stuff inside the garage. Alright. Okay, so let's uh, pick up our wheel. There we go. This is our little dumper by the looks of things. Say little. It's not that little, is it? Okay, and then we got our toolbox. You can now mount a new wheel to the underground truck. Oh, wow. Okay. So, so we do have like a little mini games, which is cool. Good job. I knew that such a simple task won't be a problem for you. There is nothing to prevent you from going to our mine now. Okay, so here we go. This is our first mining truck that we've got. Um, I'm not really sure. It's an Av... Avdu. Never really heard of that before. Don't really know much about coal mining, in all honesty. Okay, end of the underground truck. Alrighty, let's get inside. Okay. Let's have a little look at what it says that we need to do. You know what we might be all right so we'll just give it a go okay so we'll have to load it up and it seems that that is what we need to do okay god knows if, it's, if we're going to get this right door shut so the key Okay, so we're heading to the old mine. Hope the lights are working on this bad boy. Okay, oh, I forgot to mention that the previous owners left quite a mess downstairs. Alrighty, that's good. Before we get to work, you need to clean up the bits there. So we get to sell the junk. A container on the side or I'm looking at it oh maybe we throw the junk into there right that's what it's saying to us okay I get you now so as always we have to uh, pick up everything clear the workspace I suppose it's easy money Does everything have to go in there? Oh god, how am I going to get anything to fit? Oh, we should have started with all the barrels. Okay, so now we can sell that junk. How should we get for that? Wonderful! As you can see, I only managed to arrange a small container office and organize a little. But this is not the best condition, but it should be enough to get you started. And by the way, you have to have the opportunity to learn a bit about machine repair. I won't be there all the time, so I'll send you information on your tablet and what you should be doing at the moment. Go over there and see if everything works. Unfortunately, I cannot keep up with modern technology, so I had to mess something up. Alright, let's go and have a little look inside our house. Okay, yeah, nice. I mean, I don't know. Uh, here. Here's our tablet. Let's have a look then. Okay, so inside the tablet, we've got missions, shop, news, contracts, and workers. Alrighty, so, I don't know. Let's have a look at missions. Welcome to the world of coal mining. Go to the office, turn on tablet, and accept the task missions tab. 
Well, we've done that. Great, looks like you can still learn to use new devices despite my age. Now you need to connect two generators to power up the conveyor belt. All right, so let's have a look at some of this machinery that we got here. Uh, this is some mega, mega money. So I'm hoping coal mining uh, makes mega, mega money. Five miners missing, one injured in a coal mine in Poland. Oh, that's not good, is it? Gas explosions. Contracts to accept. So 150k of hard coal. Uh, Shungite reward. So it looks like there's different kinds of coals and stuff. Okay. Uh, workers. We need to progress the game to get any workers. Okay, that's fine. So, let's get out of that then. I don't think there's much more I can do here. We need to go connect up some generators, apparently. Is there anything else I can uh, linger with here? Oh, we got a table light. Do I not have a light for my head or anything? Alright, how are we connecting this up then? Plug in. Where's the second generator? All over here. I mean, it, it, it looks kind of messy, but these must be parking spots, I'm assuming, right? And what do I have? All of a sudden, I do actually have some sort of mining machine. Okay, so that's kind of cool. We got something. Okay, turn on the mobile generator. Okay. Well, I need to keep refueling this thing, though. Okay, turn on conveyor belt. Turn on all switches. Am I missing a switch? Does this need to be turned on too? Okay, this bad boy is already on. Must be another switch of that conveyor belt, right? Ah, uh, these switches. Makes sense. Okay, conveyor belt is now working. Enter the road header. Assuming that's the uh, first one, right? No, it's the second one. Okay. Let's have a look at this tutorial then very quickly. How do you work? Everything on. Okay. Is that the whole tutorial? See what happens. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I gotta exit this because apparently uh, we are wasting stuff. How do I turn you off? Obviously, we've got to just leave it running then, I'm assuming. Alright, we know this truck. Okay, we can connect that truck up. I need to get out of the truck, get back into the road, and start digging the rocks. Well, I'm assuming that is connected. It doesn't need to be turned on, right? Hey, need to move right. Exit mining mode. Interact next camera. Okay, so. How do I move it up? Ah, there 
we go. Looks like uh, changing substance in there. There's any uh, specific way. The refueling is going to be the bigger problem, I think. Okay, so the truck is full. We can exit the mining mode. Still no idea how this thing turns off. Okay, so this truck is now full. We can disconnect. I love the digital cameras on this. Right, first load of coal. Or rock, or whatever it's deciding it's going to be. Okay, and this should be a simple... Uh... There we go. And does our money go up? I mean, is that all that took? Wow. It's not a lot to get us going, is it? Do we get money? Right, I haven't seen anything go up yet, so not sure. Oops. Gonna be honest, I don't know do I need maybe accept the contract or not. Now the only thing I can think of is uh the other machines turned off. Right, maybe we should look at these contracts then. Because clearly I didn't make any money for whatever I just did. Hard coal. I don't know what shunt gate is. Oh, is this what I've already got? 105 kilos.
All right, we'll, we'll put that on there then. No idea. We'll see what happens. Okay, so this machine has to be on the uh, on position. I'm assuming only then it's really uh, using fuel, right? Okay, so that's now connected. We know we can turn that off. And we can now get back in. I can see a little bit better. the outside view okay that's a little bit better Where did we come in from? Was it here? So this is the thing now. I don't even know where we came in from. All right, Th that truck is uh, is done. I find it weird that I can't interact with any of these. It sounds like it never turns off. Okay. Surely we're going to need supports and things like that. How else are we supposed to do this? Anyway, we'll, we'll see how we go. Dump the con and go back, accept contract, and leave mine. All right, disconnect. Maybe I shouldn't have accepted that contract then. Oh, got to drive carefully. It all moves around. Don't want to lose any. Okay, so that's connected.
Okay, let's turn this off. I think I might have buggered that up a little bit. Well, how do I sell? Like, how do I accept that? So it looks like I've got 350 kilos of coal. Uh, maybe we have to sell it elsewhere. Well, that's probably worth more because we're going to get 30,000, aren't we? So, accept that contract and leave mine. These generators don't have fuel, so how do I get out of it? How did I get in? Did we come in this way? Aha. Okay. From now on, you're able to freely move inside and outside of the mine. If you want to return, you have to click on the mine doors. That's simple enough. Ah, uh, so that obviously brings it out here. And Ah, uh, look. So there's a truck here. I have to put it in the truck. Oh, bloody hell. Not my favorite thing, but there we go. Ah, screw the tutorial. We'll work it out, right? Okay, look, there's a button here. So all our coal comes out here. And now we need to enter excavator mode, I'm assuming. So press X. Right, how do I use the bucket? Okay, then we need to come out of you again. Wow, this is going to take a while. Bigger buckets will uh, definitely go a long way. Yeah, I don't really want to mess this up. I'm assuming maybe outside might be better once we kind of get used to all the buttons. So X. This moves that. That goes up. Okay. I'm not really forward enough. Which one of you is it? 10%. Alright, so we've only got to do this a few hundred times, right? So I'm assuming then clearly we can get upgrades as in buckets and stuff, which would be really good. So I should have gone for the smaller contract and this wouldn't take so long. But 30,000 would be good for new machinery and stuff, right? Okay, it's nice that you can just go through that. Otherwise that would probably make it a little bit more difficult. What? How come I didn't pick up so much? Is there a way to see how much is in my bucket? I'll have to have a look now in a second. It looks like there's still some in there. Which is odd. Alright. I don't know, maybe you got to tip it all the way. I mean, there's no way to really see how... I mean, that looks a little bucket.
Well, I can think about it unless I dropped some. Ah, that was better. So clearly my bucket scoops were terrible. Why is this not going down? No, that doesn't seem like a big bucket like I had. It's a bit fiddly, I must admit. Obviously, we'll have staff, maybe, that can do this kind of stuff for us eventually. Alright, we're not doing bad. Probably two more scoops, I'd imagine. Okay, 260. Alrighty, let's put this back over here. All the machines and stuff are quite cool. It's a great idea. Okay, let's get it back into our tunnel. So we do have things like repairs that we've got to keep an eye of all the machineries, uh, lots of other bits and pieces that we can go buy from the shop. Okay, now we're back in here. We need to go back to the contract to send it off, I believe. Complete. So now we've got 30,000. So what I've got is 120 of Shungai. So basically it, it, it separates itself and we can pick our contracts. That's pretty cool. What about missions? Welcome to the... Press tab to enter management view. Okay, well, we don't have to worry about that at the minute then.
Okay, that's the management view. So I've started going down there. Possibly. Press on the dug rock and select the option of placing a tunnel. I see. So the conveyor belt's there, so. I see. So once we drill out a whole section, we need to place tunnels. Uh, place mine phone, crossroads, low tunnel. Okay, I, I get it now. Yeah, can't do anything yet with that. How do I get out of this mode? Okay, place high tunnel there. That's what it wanted me to do. So we're actually already in there, as you can see. Okay, press the question mark to check for deposit amount and return using tab. Okay, so we can see what is available if we keep coming down. Okay, that's cool. That's a good way to see things. Press the question mark. Yep, yeah, using tab. All is good. Okay, so we know what materials would be down there. Let's just have a look at our new tunnel. Well, I didn't really dig all of it. So I feel like we could have got a lot more before this uh, happened. But anyways, it doesn't matter. It's part of where we need to be. My more cars so you can forward the drill rig. And how much will the drill rig cost? We'll leave this at episode number one. Um, but let's just see where we're at for a drill, drill rig. 50,000. What's so special about this? It allows you to insert dynamite. Oh, wow. So that's going to uh, blow things up pretty damn quickly. Um... New one of them, bigger dumpers. Ah, uh, this is like a card got up and down and around. That's pretty cool. Okay, I'm not sure. Obviously, that must be like another attachment or something. I'm not entirely sure what that is. What the hell is that? Used for mining with higher speed but lower range. Yeah, it can't go so high. Face all used for transporting rocks from lower tunnels. Uh, used for transporting leftover rock. Okay. Allows you to extract coal and dig tunnels. So that's like the bigger version of what we got. Use transporting coal. Okay. Damn, shame that this game's not multiplayer. Because imagine that. Obviously, we get the higher stuff. But imagine if we had multiplayer. This would be so good. Okay, guys. So there we go. We dug our first tunnel. We've made a little bit of money. We're going to continue on in the next episode. Hopefully, you're enjoying this. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think. Let me know if you're picking this up. Which list it on Steam now. It will be available as of tomorrow. And other than that, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.